So as I said, I'm Roger Goodman. I'm the state representative, the chair of the House Public Safety Committee in the House of Representatives. And uh, cannabis used to be in my jurisdiction because it used to be illegal, but now it's in the Commerce Committee jurisdiction, which is pretty cool. Um, and we now have not just the Liquor Control Board, the Liquor and Cannabis Board, officially, as of a few weeks ago. So a lot of changes happening here in Washington, helping to lead the world again. It's really uh, sort of parallel universes. We cannot forget what's going on in the rest of the country. And some are making more progress uh, than others. But Washington needs to be careful as we continue to lead the way. Uh, but so far, I think it's, it's doing well. It's doing well enough. The market, the commercial market, has a time to settle down. But we have to worry about people who are truly medically needy. People who don't want to take the toxic petrochemical pharmaceuticals. And they depend on it, and they need a lot of it. They don't smoke it or vaporize it. It's oil, and they ingest it. And it's, uh, they, they, don't, they can't afford it. So I'm worried about that. And in the legislature, I'm going to continue to be a voice to take care of the truly medically needy. On the other hand, we have, not really on the other hand, but another issue, major issue, is the market itself. This new legal market, which so far I think is, is a showcase. We have a lot of flaws, and yet with more retail availability and a sort of a supply and taxation that makes sense, it will take years to adjust. Uh, we will, again, show the world how it should be done. So the dam has burst. Cannabis prohibition is over. The war on marijuana is over. And we'll look back on history, you know, but we were still fighting it and it still cost a lot and so forth. But in the minds of Americans, and really in the minds of the world, the war on marijuana is over. So to preside over that, after having been a drug policy reformer, when I got elected, boy, they hit me hard. He wants to legalize marijuana. My vote went way up after that, after the people found out. The people are way ahead of the politicians and the opinion leaders. And so it's fun to be ahead of the curve and to kind of say, I told you so. But we're doing it right. And so it's part of, I'm proud to be a part of that. So thank you very much. Thanks to Hempfest. Keep it up. Keep up your voice.